Good morning. No, it's not. It's good afternoon. Hi, it's uh, June the 30th. It's just after about 12.30. And I have, finally, my ferry ticket. It's on board the Balakan. I also have a Kazakhstan visa that is uh, valid from July the 1st. I also have my Azerbaijan visa and my registration document. What could go wrong? And that is tempting fate. It's uh, 9.40 on uh, Monday night. I've just gone through the Azerbaijan um, border control at this port. Uh, I was really worried because I have two passports, one with my Azerbaijan visa, uh, which they now stamped, and then I had a Kazakhstan visa in a second passport. And they kept on asking for the second passport, and then they looked at the second one, then they looked at the first one, and I, my heart was going like a train at that point. Anyway, they've let me in. Sorry, they've let me out. I don't know whether you can see this, but I'm having to drive my bike in between railway lines. Well, this is the Balakan. Uh, I'm now trying to find out how to get on it. It's all a bit of a mystery at the moment. Maybe it's at the back. Okay. Well, now the, now the train is pushing out. So they've just shunted this train onto the uh, I'm now on board and uh, you can see they've laid the red carpet for me and as we go outside uh, the trains have gone so I think we're just waiting for more trains and uh, freight to arrive but I'll uh, this end of the boat I think is uh, I don't know whether this is the stern or the bow quite honestly anyway um, all red carpet and uh, these are, I think, the cabins. And then what I'm going to go into next is the closest you're going to get to Langan's Brasserie. I've just been given dinner. This is the uh, cabin on board the Balakan. So we have uh, a bunk there, a bunk there. <coughs> Oh dear, that doesn't look quite so clever. Mm. <clears throat> right, let's start that one again. <laughs> Once someone hadn't flushed it. Anyway, um, apart from the toilet being completely full of uh, you know what, um, it's not bad. So it's uh, 30 minutes after midnight and looks like we've got uh, our cargo on board. Hopefully we'll be leaving soon. Hi, it's uh, 10.30 uh, in the morning on uh, July the 1st. Uh, I'm on board the ferry Balakan and we eventually left Baku at about 5 o'clock uh, this morning. So we haven't been going uh, too long. Uh, over in the distance there, I don't know if you can see it, but there is uh, another ship, uh, the sister ship to this one, and there's also one in front of us. So we are going in convoy to uh, Aktau. Uh, but so far, the trip has gone very smoothly. Somewhat strangely, the freight that I uh, videoed last night, before we left, is not the freight that's on here now, so they must have shunted the uh, oil wagons backwards and forwards and got this lot on. Apparently the cargo we are carrying is dead chickens from Australia. The ship's cook. Ship's cook? There's no. No? No. Cooking up a nice omelette by the looks of things. I've been hanging around outside and they've just invited me into the wheelhouse. And this is it. This is there's no big no big wheel. No big wheel. Oh there. Well that's the wheel. 
Oh, wow. <laughs> that is, that's about the size of a small steering wheel. Amazing. And uh, you are the helmsman. Yes? Yes. Uh, just showing me the screen with uh, a ship in front of us, the Barda, which is the sister ship to this one. And there's another one behind us, Zafira Alieva. But yeah, pretty impressive. Very impressive. Should have had this on the clipper boat. And then we have the barter in front. Up there. It's uh, 8.30 in the morning on uh, Thursday, July the 3rd. And Aktau is tantalizingly close. Feels a bit like being on Alcatraz. I'm in the crew accommodation area and I've been speaking to the second officer. He reckons we'll arrive in Aktau sometime in the early hours of Wednesday morning, probably about three or four o'clock. The problem we have is that there are three boats ahead of us that need to dock and unload. So we could be anchored outside of Aktau for up to 24 hours before we can get in and unload ourselves. So it might be Thursday uh, before I get off this boat. I must have walked around this ship about four times. I can't find the swimming pool. I can't find the entertainment theater. I can't find the casino. Apparently I've just been told that uh, dinner is at seven and uh, pre-dinner drinks at 6.30. No, actually it's not. It's just dinner at 7. It's Wednesday, July the 2nd, about uh, 11 o'clock in the morning. We anchored off Aktau at 2.30 uh, this morning. I know, because I heard the bloody train go clank, 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 clank. Anyway, we're in Aktau. I'll just spin round, and uh, you can see Aktau in the distance and the two ships that came up with us, the Barda and the other one. Uh, the Barda has to go in first and then we'll be allowed in. There are two ships already in so we can't go in. So it could be another day, it could be two days while I'm stuck here. This is the uh, deck entertainment. It's uh, just after 7 o'clock in the morning, uh, we docked at 4.30 and I'm finally through customs and passport control. I am now in Kazakhstan.